Hi, and welcome to this Dreamweaver tutorial. My name is Daniel Walter Scott, and I'm a trainer here at Bring Your Own Laptop. Um, in this course, what we're gonna look at is CSS. What CSS will allow us to do is to style all of our HTML. So currently we've got our vintage camper page, and we've got our H1s, our H2s, our paragraph tags, and some links, but we haven't been able to change the color or the size of the font. So this is what this next, the next section is about. So we're gonna create um, uh, a separate sheet called a CSS sheet, which is short for cascading style sheet, and we're gonna style those fonts. So I've got this file here open for you. This is um, one of my websites. It's the Bring Your Own Laptop website that I created for the Australian site. Now you can see it's kind of like our uh, vintage camper. It's quite simple, images, everything's in line. But what I'll show you is I've created a CSS sheet. I've turned it off for the moment just to show you what it looks like without the CSS. So quite similar. There's a lot more um, text in this version, but quite similar to the vintage camper one. So what I'll do is I'll turn the CSS back on. So let's find this view, style rendering, display style. So this is going to turn my CSS back on. And can you see it's changed the site quite substantially okay all the css styles and um, all the fonts it styles the layout and this um, part of the tutorial we're going to look at just styling the fonts to start with we'll look at layout in a later one so um, let's have a look at split view so on the right here is my html with the css applied and this is what css looks like it's quite similar to html okay but it's a little simpler okay it's nice and easy to use so on this right hand side here, um, I've got this bit of text highlighted and you can see down the bottom here, it's called blog two. Um, okay, so it's got this thing called blog two that I've added to it, just the name. Um, and over here, I've styled blog two and I've told it to be a font size of 1.2 ems, which is the size of the font. I've given it a font family. So Museo Sans rounded, that's what I've decided for this one. Um, it's got a text shadow, so drop shadow. Um, it's a white one that's over the side there, and these are the colors that make that work. And the line height is the leading or the space between lines, and the font weight is how heavy it is. Um, so is it a light, is it a medium, is it a bold, is it a black? So those are the things styling um, this uh, blog post to here text. Okay, so I can make changes in my code in the CSS and watch it update on the right hand side. So I'm going to change this to a bigger size, so 1.7, and you'll watch over here, it updates to 1.7. Great, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna um, create our um, CSS sheet, okay, and we're gonna do some font styling and try and get our vintage camper site looking a little more trick. All right, so see you in the next tutorial. 